Yes? Are you okay? I cannot move. Well, you're still really rusty. That is true. Hold on, ASDF Gaming and I will find a way to help you. Hello everyone, my name is ASDF, welcome back to One Shot. Now the last thing we did at the end of yesterday, well just after the end of yesterday's episode, is I took a nap because Nico said that he was feeling really tired and this is the screen that was presented to me when I started the game, so I left it here. <laughs> Thanks for the nice setup compliment by the way. I don't know if he's dreaming or what's going on here. But it looks interesting. I'll kill my music. That was interesting. ASDF Gaming, are you still there? Yes. Ah, I'm awake. I had a dream just now. I saw. <laughs> you did? Wow. I... I really thought I was back home. Oh, the sun back in my world isn't a light bulb. It's a big ball of fire in the sky. I don't think I'd be able to hold it like I do with the sun from your world. This isn't my world. Huh? This isn't the world I live in. Wow, this is getting pretty meta. Really? Uh, I guess not. If you're the god of this world, you wouldn't necessarily be in it. What's your homeworld called? That, that's a secret there, Nico. I see. Does your world have a sun? I can't tell you that we can be really elusive. What's up, Krieger? <laughs> also, hello, Yoshi. Yes, it's uh, also a big ball of fire. Really? Wow. His eyes. Wow. Can you hold it? That was a silly question, wasn't it? If your last name is Octavius, you can hold it. <laughs> the sun in my homeworld is very bright. Warm, too. You saw, right? But it goes away sometimes, at night. Everything gets dark, kind of like how this world is now. But it's only because the sun always comes back the next day. That's good, don't you think? I'm gonna just say yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. During the night, people usually go to sleep, but some people stay up and use computers. I don't have to explain what they are, do I? There's a bunch of them in this world. Uh, anyway, we, we should probably get going. All right, well, so we need, we need to find a gas mask. Um, I had a map pulled up of this kind of area. Um, we don't have anything to power that boat. Let's just refresh our, our notes. Oh, that's just controls. And, and gameplay and other oh okay let's let's refresh our inventory that's not it it's this one screwdriver empty bottle camera broken battery and crowbar we need a gas mask to go up into the gassy area and we need to figure out how to fix the battery although I don't know what order that would be in now we saw a note um, to the east in the in the cliffs that said something about like gas mask stores. What's up Leviathan? How you doing? We're looking for a gas mask. I don't know if that's the right order but That's that's the order we're choosing to do it in. We also need a vehicle to go into the mines, but so far I don't think we have one So I'm not entirely sure what to do. Maybe I can talk to profit Hello again. Are there more questions you wish to ask? Yes. Mm-hmm. Go on then, ask away. Can you tell me about the Baron? Well, we already did the Barons. Oh, the tower. How how tall is the tower? I can't even I can't seem to even see the top. I am not allowed to answer. But how do I get up there? In time, ASDF Gaming will know what to do. Oh, I will, will I? I think you have a lot more faith in me than I do, sir. Okay, let's go in here. Now this is where we got the battery from. And there was a square hole. Something used to fit. So the battery used to fit there, but we need to fix it and then charge it probably. And I don't think the gas mask storage is in here, although maybe. No, it doesn't look like it. A robot without power, can't do anything with those. Still, This is the map, right? Yeah, it's not entirely helpful for us. Okay, well, this building we've done, we're done with until we figure out how to fix that battery. There's this guy. Um, hello? ASDF Gaming, are you there? Yes. Oh, good. 
There's a robot here attached to the boat. It doesn't seem to have power and its joints are rusted over as well. But I think we should be able to fix it. After all, we'll need to cross this ocean to get to the tower. Okay, so we need something for his joints. An empty bottle we might be able to fill up with, um... I'm not gonna smash the bottle. Might be able to fill up with oil or something. Maybe. Maybe, baby. I'm totally stuck, man. I'm pretty sure I've got to be missing something. What am I missing, guys? What, what am I missing? We've got a screwdriver that we haven't used for anything. We've got the light bulb and the camera. Maybe we can combine the camera and the light bulb. I can't combine those. Can't combine those. Can't combine those. No. 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 Okay. Well, I'm totally stuck. Two hours later. We gotta look it up. Oh, man. The one thing in my inventory that I did not attempt to combine is... Okay. So, we need to unscrew the lens from the camera. Done. Now we have a lens that we can put in the battery. Okay, now we have an empty battery. Well, wow, all that, man. All that. Okay. Now we can go back to the entrance. Can't believe it. We had it this whole time. I'm telling you. I am just not good with those kinds of things. And we tried literally everything else. Sorry, I had to move my mouse over. We tried literally everything else. And... Um, all the other combinations. I just didn't think to use the screwdriver on a camera. Alright, let's get this plugged in now. We might have to charge it, but let's see if it fits back in here. Battery fits in the slot perfectly. Looks like we're on the right track, but nothing happened. Okay, so we have the battery now. Isn't this like a battery charger? The word profit bots written on the side? No. Okay, so we need to charge the battery now, somehow. Do you need further assistance? We're good, thanks. Okay, so... Ow, I got shocked. I told you not to touch it. ASTF made me. Hey, don't go blaming me, Nico. I know I made you do it, but that's no excuse. Okay, empty power cell. Empty power cell. Do we have a charger? Oh, we do. Okay, hold up. I read a little bit further. We're using the sun directly on the battery? I would have never thought of that. Good thinking, ASDF Gaming. Ah, oh, looks like it's already fully charged. That was fast. Okay, now we have a charged battery. Now let's go back to the outpost. And we'll shove this in the machine, because it's charged now. Let's hope the charged battery does something. Oh. Oh, it's do- Oh, that's a big old battery. Whoa! Okay, so that's going now. What did that do for us? All the robots are active. I am functional! Did your- did you power the generator? I guess we did. Right, ASTF Gaming? Yes. Okay, now we can talk to the robots. I am functional! I can walk! Oh, that's cute. Okay, there were robots in- there were robots everywhere, so I guess we just gotta go talk to all the robots now. I'm gonna keep looking around areas that I haven't gone since we powered the thing on. Uh, no more questions. Okay. I thought maybe he would tell us something story related. There were robots in here that were just not powered on. Hello, organic life form. Hello. They're happy. Oh, hello. Hi. I have power again. Yup. Is it worth talking? Oh, hello! Hi! <laughs> Is it worth talking to all of them? Probably not. Okay, these guys aren't doing anything. Those guys aren't powered on. So we need to go find... Maybe the rowboat guy... Is set now? We just need to lube him up somehow. Let's go back... There's nothing on the cliffs that that would have affected that I know of. Let's go back to the lookout point. See if she has anything to say. Now that the thing is powered back on. 
No, she has nothing new to say. Okay, then let's go back to the docks. And we'll see what's new over here. The computers still aren't powered on. Let's see if this guy can talk now. Can you talk? I am functional. Was it you who fixed the generator? Well, ASDF Gaming helped me. But yeah. Whoa, thanks for the cheer. 500 bits from Cheesy. Oh, thank you so much. Hello, nice to meet you. I am robot... R robot... Robot number 310. Would you like me to take you somewhere? Yes? Are you okay? I cannot move. Well, you're still really rusty. That is true. Hold on, ASDF Gaming and I'll find a way to help you. Okay, we gotta de-rust the robot. Yeah, 500 bits, that is quite a cheer. So now there's power to the robots, which means hopefully we can figure out how to get the gas mask. Oh, the computer. We gotta go check the computer because that's probably active now. That, that's probably it. And that one's gonna have the code to the safe. Almost guaranteed. I am functional. Mm-hmm. All right, those guys are just flavor. At least for now. There's probably gonna be one of them. They're like 98% flavor and one of them is gonna have a hint that helps us. Yeah, the computer. I've, I've seen you made progress in this world, ASDF Gaming. But that progress stops here. Oh, that's ominous. I believe you need a code to unlock a certain box. Well, the code no longer exists in this world. Oh, thank you for the jump scare. Do you understand what this means, ASDF Gaming? Yes. Good. Start looking. So it's probably in my documents folder, right? Document.oneshot.txt. This showed up. And we'll look at this. Oh, baby. This game is amazing so far. Um, it's a little encrypted. It's it's a little, I would say, more corrupted than encrypted. Message to you, I'm afraid. I must make it brief. I've left you a journal, part of which is written in a language that... Uh, read it and you will know what to do. I have also... Uh, looked for a metal safe in the quarry to the east, somewhere between the ocean and the lookout point. The code you need is 576848. Okay, 576848. 576848. 576848. Okay, here we go. We can uh, get rid of the display capture now. 576848. Eight. Alright, you're gonna head out. Have a good time, Cheesy. Thanks for dropping by. Thanks for the bits, too. 576848. 576848. Oh, you guys are on it. I don't have to remember anything. I got you guys. Alright, we'll move the mouse again to behind my face. I don't think this is the way. Oh, it was literally where we were headed. 576848 576848 That's not that that is not mm -mm. okay 576848 Boom Whoa it worked Wait how did you know the code ESDF gaming? I, I still don't remember seeing one. I had some help. Really? From who? Don't worry about it. Okay. What's in the safe, Nico? Oh, right. Let's see. Ah, oh, I found a gas mask. Also, there's this weird looking book. I can't read it, though. Not that I can't read or anything, because I can. I just don't know what language this is. It's... It's empty. Oh, yeah, okay. So, we got the gas mask. I tried to open my inventory and that happened. What is that? Man, I don't even know. Okay, gas mask is on. I'll wear it when I have to. Okay, gas mask we don't have to do anything with. Let me let me look at the strange journal. Okay, we can't do anything with it yet. But now we can go to the north, and we're still doing okay on time too, so let's get let's get cracking on going north into the gas, the, the vapor, gas something area. I should be fine with this mask on. All right, cool. So it's a gas vent.
I'm just looking everywhere to see if there's like any buildings or anything that I'm gonna miss. So we're on the outer portion, we're on the right side of that donut ring. That the, you know how the map is like, the, the barons wrap around other things? Hello! Hello, person! Welcome to the old chemical processing plant! Oh, you guys got any oil? Most of the equipment has already been relocated. To, relocated to where? From where? To who? Okay, I see those. Let me pick those up. It's a pair of rubber gloves. They're a bit heavy. Okay. What if we grab the crowbar? Good thing I kept this crowbar. Always keep stuff, as long as it doesn't break. What a workout. Let's read this note. Seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Cannot overstate the importance of cleaning solvents in this environment. Here's a simple recipe using the alternative method discussed in the last chapter, utilizing the natural properties of blue phosphor. Regents, as acidic gas and blue phosphor rare form. In a well-ventilated area, direct the gas into your container of choice. Seal immediately. That's the end of the page. Okay. Container of choice. We have a bottle. It seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. Shake vigorously to initiate the reaction. Use as soon as possible. Note, if elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Also note, hand protection is critical after this step. The resulting acid is moderately stronger than common household cleaners. I don't understand what half of these words mean. It's a good thing you're here, ASDF Gaming. There is a cleaning sponge with a rough surface. Okay. That's good. We'll need that to clean off that robot. The ro-bot. Ha 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 ha. What a pun. Okay. Well, is this... We need blue phosphor rare form. I don't know what blue phosphor rare form is, but we'll keep an eye out for something that looks like blue phosphor. And then we also needed something else, right? Okay, there's something weird about the robots who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate rust at a much slower rate than the others. The few who work directly with gas harvesting look practically new. Is that a result of the atmosphere, or am I just seeing things? So the gas helps to eliminate the rust. Oh, new, new zone. Whoa, you're big. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? Hmm? A living person such as yourself should have evacuated this place long ago. Oh, but I just got here. T to this world, I mean. See, I have the sun. <laughs> this just holds up the big light bulb. Oh, the Messiah. I do not know what to say. Greeting you is not part of my programming. Have you spoken to ProfitBot? I think so, yeah. ProfitBot built was built with the sole purpose of greeting you. Really? Yes, he cannot speak with anyone else. At least, not with ease. Oh, that's kind of sad. What are you built for then? My purpose is to guard this settlement. Even though the residents have long gone, I must remain. Ah, oh, why though? I have not been tamed. Tamed? It was not worth the effort. Okay. Taming seems to give robots free will. Looks like they're evacuating the few tamed robots we have here. Makes sense, no point in keeping them in the barrens if all the people are already gone. I wonder if the engineer is going too. He was the one responsible for all the upkeep of robots. Apparently phase one of the evacuation ended prematurely. The big ship started malfunctioning only after a few round trips. They said it was due to something with squares. I'm not sure what they mean by that. Oh, the corruption. Bummer. Looks like they won't be able to transport most of these surplus bots to the city at that rate. And we work so hard on those. But I suppose the robots are <laughs> robots are busy enough with transporting people as is. I think it's going to be our turn soon. Is this the ladder? Yeah. Get on up there. I'm scared of ladders. Okay. I won't make you go up. It's a power cell, I, th I think. There's writing on this one too. It says guardian of residential area. Well, it's a little shrimp in the jar. Unit RM2883417 reporting for duty. I saw that you spoke with the guardian of the settlement. I will now escort you until you reach your dormitory. Um, what? 
we need to follow him? Oh, he's fo- no, I, I have no idea what that guy's all about. Oh, this is so pretty. Everything's so pretty here. Oh, we're going back? Let's not go back there yet. I don't know that there's anything other than that building, the chemical plant. It said, okay. So it said to capture something in a container. We have a bottle. Is he the settlement guardian, guardian of the settlement? <laughs> ASDF quivers before him. Hey, I ain't quivering before nobody. Infirmary. Oh, hi. Hello, person of organic makeup. Welcome to the infirmary. Scanning for injuries. Um, scan complete. Injuries detected. None. Treatment required. None. You are good to go. Are... Thanks? <laughs> nice. It's a box of medical tools. Most of them are broken or rusted beyond use, but this plastic syringe seems to be okay. We needed that. We needed the plastic syringe for something. We gotta fill... There's two ingredients. There's something and something. The blue phosphor rare form is one. Hello, person. Are you seeking admission into the infirmary? No? Oh, carry on then. Can I go around him? No, okay. So we can't get into the infirmary, but we needed that plastic syringe. I wonder, okay, let me look at the inventory real quick. We need blue phosphor rare form. Don't know where I'm gonna get that. Looks like we're supposed to pack stuff for the evacuation starting today. I wish these books weren't so heavy. It's gonna be a pain to carry them onto the ship. Looking at you, person who has lots of books that helps people, that asks people for help when you move. I see you. Books are heavy. Digital books are light, uh, but they're by the author. I can't just throw them away. Okay, books by the author. Hey, sweetie, six more weeks until you can come home. About time, huh? Gosh, I can't imagine living in that awful, awful capsule wall dorm thing. But guess what? Soon you'll be able to sleep in a real bed and eat real food again. Right back soon. Love, mom. Aw. So these are dorms for humans. That's not great living conditions. Hydrate. Thank you for the hydrate reminder. Mm. Uh, you can follow me if you want. Okay, they aren't really escorting me though. Oh. I guess they are escorting me. Okay. Go interact with the ladder? Okay, I'll go interact with the ladder. Am I gonna help Nico face his fears of ladders? Oh, that would be so cute if I could talk him through it. I'm scared of ladders. Should I try it again? This is for you, Leviathan. I'm scared of ladders. <laughs> This building, maybe? This is a dorm, too. A robot, it's beyond repair. Is there gonna be something at the top of one of these that I need to get? I don't know. I'm scared of ladders. Evacuation at such short notice? I can't believe this. First the sun dies, now I'm out of a job. Some sort of mechanical drawing. Okay, can, you, can we look at it? Okay, so we've gone through all these buildings. Let's keep going to the left. Maybe I'm supposed to follow this guy. No, he's following me. Okay. We'll keep on moving around. We'll keep on exploring and then uh, we'll, we'll stew on how to put these pieces together. That way the streams will go a little smoother. I'm looking for some kind of blue phosphor rare form. Oh, ooh. What's that? This vent is on the ground. All the others are taller than me. Okay. Initially, the amount of noxious fumes emitted by the natural gas vents caught our team off guard. Thank goodness the medical team reacted as quickly as they did. Despite its failure, that first expedition did bring up some interesting observations about the Barrens. We found that there's not one, but two such vent zones. With fumes being pumped out at such high concentrations, it seems a miracle that the gas hasn't spread anywhere yet. 
Our biologists concluded that the phosphor shrimp in the crater pools were actively consuming the gas. The shrimp in the ocean also prevented the gas from wafting off into the glen. If that's the case, then we owe a lot to these little guys. Okay. Well, let's see if we can capture this. Oop. Uh... I guess you want me to fill the bottle with the gas, ASDF Gaming? Yes. That ought to do it. Okay, let's see what we got. Bottle of smoke, and then we need to use the syringe to get whatever the blue phosphor rare form is, because now we have the vapor. So let's just like use the syringe on everything that we can. We've already tried using the syringe on that. Didn't work. I hope we don't need to, like, fish some shrimp and extract it from shrimp. You must catch 48 more shrimp to fill this syringe. Oh, look at that. So, we're filling up the syringe, ASDF Gaming? Oh, yeah. I guess it's kind of like a funnel. But the liquid might be a bit too thick to fit in the needle. Hey, it actually went in. Gross. I don't even know what this is. This pond sure looks different. The water looks like jelly? It's formed a bubble over the surface of the pond. Okay, well, that, those are the ingredients that we needed, so now we can combine them, because we have gloves, right? Oh, the sky is dark. That it is. Do you know when the sun will be back up? We're working on it. It's right here if you want to touch it. Okay, let's see if we can combine those in our inventory. Should I inject the liquid through the cork? Right, SDF Gaming? Yep. It's like I'm a doctor. Oh, I should probably shake this, too. He changed color! Okay, we have a bottle of acid now. So now we can use that on the, the robot. Maybe we combine it with the sponge. Well, it says, to, it says to use it immediately, right? So let's go down. We'll see if we can get down to the robot. It should be like right under here. This loop should have been... I mean, we definitely went the right way. Because otherwise we would have been going backwards. We should be able to get it on this guy. I need something I can use to wash the robot with. Okay, how about a sponge? I'm guessing you want me to pour the acid onto this sponge, ASDF Gaming? Good thing I have these gloves. Good thing the sponge doesn't just dissolve. I hope this works. Okay, wet sponge. All right, hold still. I have no other choice. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Rub-a-dub, dub. Rub-a-dub, scrub, scrub. Rub-a-dub. There, how's that? I can move again. Thank you. Oh, a little heart. I am able to fulfill my purpose again. Where would you like to go? Can you take me to the tower? Calculating. Closest destination to the tower is the Glen port number. My built-in navigation circuits have fried. I'm gonna assume that's not good. It is not good at all. Once again, I cannot follow my programming. Oh, is there anything I can do to help? In the event of an error, you should speak with the head engineer. She will know what to do. She will know what to do. Maybe Pink Hair Lady is the head engineer. And she's at the lookout point, right? Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me again, miss. I found a robot who can take me toward the tower. But it's having some trouble, so it told me to talk to you. All right. What is the issue? said something about its navigation circuits being fried. Just the navigation circuits? Apparently. <laughs> ASDF Gaming and I fixed everything else, I think. Hmm. I have something that may help. Robots have the ability to trace material from their source locations. If you let the robo bar robot borrow this, then its backup tracking system should activate. Oh, the token of luck. It's a very pretty necklace. What's it made of? Amber found from the glen. What's the thing inside the amber? The black clover? That's a common plant in our world. It's also... Ah, I'm not sure if I can bear it apart with this. My programming says yes, but I still feel conflicted. Never mind. You need to finish your mission more than I need a keepsake. Here. Oh, thank you. Okay, so we got the, the... Before I go, is there anything I can do in return? 
Actually, do you know how to play chess? Yeah! Well, sort of. I've played it with some older kids before. Then, will you play a game with me? I mean, I don't know the rules very well, but I guess it's the least I can do. You're really good at this. Thank you. It was built into my code. Ah, so what's it like? Being a robot and all. I've talked to other robots and they all say something about programming and code and stuff. Even you did just now. It's a little hard to understand sometimes. I know. Most of the robots here are not tamed. Tamed? Watch out. There goes my bishop. <laughs> Taming. It's complicated. Oh? How complicated exactly? There goes my other bishop. Can't really explain what tamed robots are. But I'm one of them. All of the other tamed robots have been moved to other regions. Exactly where, I don't know. Oh? There goes my little horse! Oh. Knight. Right. Oh, have you been to any other regions? I heard there's two more. In the past, yes. I still have the data, the coordinates, the memories. I don't know how much of that still holds true. The world may be a very different place now. Because the sun is gone? No. I said this already, didn't I? The sun probably won't save the world. The decaying started back before the sun went out. The sun's sudden death was just the tipping point. And things went south really fast after that. Oh. Then there's nothing I can do? Check. What? When did your queen get there? The only thing you can do is complete your pilgrimage. In a way. You're only supposed to be a second chance for the people. Just like how the Barons was only supposed to be a second chance for me. There's no guarantee that things will work out. But... Checkmate. Alright, I guess I've kept you long enough. Thank you for listening. I hope you get home safely. Oh, thank you also! Oh, that was sweet. Okay, we can fast travel now to where the rowboat is. Docks. He was up here, right? No, this is where the gas is. I love the yellow eyes. So he's south of the docks. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, this is Amber from the Glen. I remember now. Activating tracking system. Setting course. Wait, this boat is over capacity. You'll need to leave behind some of your possessions. Oh, well, I don't think I'll be needing this crowbar anymore. It just throws it in the lake. Or this gas mask and gloves. He does just throw it in the lake. Go put it by the bed or something. That is acceptable. Onwards we go. That's nice, though. It simplifies the puzzles in the future. Oh, I gotta screenshot this. You guys know I love my screenshots. Oh, wait. It's moving on its own. Oh! Oh, no, I missed it! No! What if I Alt F for it? Here is your stop. The Glen. Thank you. There should be a village to the north, but that's all I can recall. Oh, that's good to know. Farewell. May your mission be a success. Are, are you leaving? Yes. I must return to my station. But you'll be all alone again. It's okay. I have not been tamed. Hmm. I'm taking screenshots. I can piece that whole thing together. Oh, cool. I like this already. Oh, man. We should probably do this tomorrow, though. We should probably explore the Glen tomorrow. Oh, wait, who are you? I'm catching fireflies for mommy. Oh, okay. 
Is it the jar of fireflies? Fly, 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 fireflies? Oh, it's so relaxing here. Okay, so the village was to the north. This is probably the village to the north. You're gonna get dizzy if you keep spinning around like that. I am the tower! Huh? Grandpa says the tower used to spin all the time, bringing sunlight to the world. I want to see it too. Well, I'm here now. I guess it'll only be a matter of time again. Is it a lighthouse? It's probably a lighthouse. It spins, bringing light to the world. Most of the green moss covering our village has already lost its glow. If it wasn't for the thin strip left on the boundaries of the land, people could easily fall into the ocean. Without light, land and water becomes indistinguishable here. Oh. Good thing you have all these fireflies. Not ready yet, but would you like some stew? I'm not hungry, but thank you. It's the least I can offer the savior. Some jars. Should we break them? See if there's any rupees in them? Like the bed. Well, more like a mattress, but I can't sleep in it because it's not my bed. Wow! Is that the sun? Yeah. Are you holding it? <laughs> Isn't it hot? Not really. It's nice and warm. Hmm. Okay, she's spinning. Oh, you look different. Last week I saw more of those squares while out fishing. I knew better than to get too close, though. Squares? Squares, man, they're bad news. We saw the squares. Oh, we can go in here. Haha. -ha. Daddy says the world is very sick, but ASDF Gaming can make it better again. Are you ASDF Gaming? Uh, not really. I'm just the messiah they sent. I can talk with ASDF Gaming, though. Wow! What's that like? Really cool. There you go. Oh, a sheep! A goat? A ram. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna do that one. I'm gonna strain my vocal cords doing that. It's slowly being chipped away already. But it's still trying to stay alive, I think. Doesn't matter, one day the world will finally give up this fight. I just hope I'm not alive to see it. I'm bringing back the sun, though. That won't fix the root of the problem. Just like the other lady said. But don't lose heart. Without the sun, the world will die much faster. At the very least, I'm sure everyone would like to see the sun again. Oh, the people have lost hope. The land is fragmenting at an alarming rate. I don't like to think about the day when this town finally loses to the intruding sea. We have to find another place to settle. I thought all the humans were evacuated though, maybe it was just from the barrens. Oh, whoa, okay. This is it, the last of our grain surpluses. And now we're dealing with a vermin problem. Maybe you can get cats? Not that I'm a cat, I mean. Oats. This looks like flour. A jar of some sort of grain. Heads of wheat. Heads of wheat. Okay, I was like, are they? do they all say something different to say that there's grain in it? Oh, yeah. We've seen... You, oh, we've seen you already. Okay. I think that's all the houses that we can go in. I know I said we'd explore this next week, but we can do a little bit of exploration. The light from these lanterns will have to do for now. I'm starting to see some very small sprouts. Probably take some time for these to bear fruit. Aww. There's sprouts, small sprouts. I gotta be careful I don't step on these. Oh, what happens if I step on them though? I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try to find out. That just seems mean. Look at all these goats. Well, rams. Is this a goat puzzle? It looks like a goat puzzle. Okay. I don't know how to do the puzzle, but looks like a goat puzzle. Oh, a merchant! Hey ya! You here to trade? <laughs> trade? Yeah! Is there anything you want to get rid of? 
Make an offer and I'll give you something in return. Hmm. Do we have something like that, ASDF Gaming? We have the journal, we have the amber, and we have the light bulb. Can I trade the light bulb? I wonder if I get an achievement for trying to trade the light bulb. ASDF Gaming, no. Okay, yeah, no. Can't combine those. We can try the amber, though. I don't think it's right to trade this away, ASDF Gaming. Oh, hey, you have one of those coin things. I've dug up a couple of those before. Oh? Yeah, there's this guy who would trade me the best things for them. Oh? Like one time he brought me this little machine that plays music. <laughs> I don't know what it's called, but you have to wind it up. A music box? That's it! I wish that guy would come back soon, I haven't seen him in forever. I want to do more trades with him. Hmm. I don't know who that would be. I'm looking for a bed. The door is full of vines, ASDF Gaming. We don't have anything to cut through the vines. I don't really want to trade the journal away either. So we need to get into there. So we'll probably need to find something to trade this guy for a machete or something. But until we have something to trade with that guy, maybe we'll see what's over here. Some kind of cloak or shawl folded neatly. A pair of shoes and some jewelry. It's a staff. Reminds me of that one robot from the Barons was holding. It's an orb. The material looks like amber. This looks like an altar. What if I put the thing on the altar? Okay, guess we're fast traveling. I didn't mean to. Definitely didn't mean to fast travel there. I just pushed all the buttons. I spammed them. Just like how I play Smash Bros. I'm not very good at Smash Bros. Can you tell? The flood can take away our farmlands, but it can't take away our fish. Huh, guess that's true. The one saving grace in a flood. Okay, let's see. Okay, I don't think we can do anything with the altar currently. Dude, that go to spin it. Oh, hi! Hello! I... need some... I... <laughs> anime, anime glasses, I need someone to fix my ramps. Oh, I can do that! I've seen some grown-ups do it back home, you just kind of push them around. Hmm... But you are carrying the sun. Ah, oh, wait, can't you just watch the sun for me? I cannot. I am but a simple shepherd. Um, okay. Come back when your hands are free. You will be rewarded if you can herd my rams. Okay, okay, well, okay. Space apparently does the same thing as Z. Okay, let's, let's, uh, there we go. Hello. I heard my rams. I can do that. I've seen some grown-ups. Hmm, but you're carrying the sun. Oh, okay. We'll have to do it when we don't have the sun, so... Alright, looking for a bed! Crops have been growing poorly without the sun, and there's no telling how long our surpluses will last. Please, Savior, you have to hurry. I... I'll do my best! Well, there's no bed here that I can sleep in. Maybe there's something to the south. Because we're coming up to the end of our time. There's a time where people used to live in these ruins, but due to flooding, most of us have moved to less permanent settlements. Flooding? Aye, the land has gotten brittle. The glen used to be in one piece, you know. But now it's just a bunch of islands that get smaller and smaller. Ah. Uh. Okay, we won't talk to... Might as well talk to everybody. Hmm. Nothing's biting. While well, you're fishing in a really tiny river, maybe if you switch to a bigger spot, things would bite. Whoa. Alula? Alula, where did you go? ASDF Gaming, did you hear that? Alula! I think it's coming from southeast of here. Alright, we can go southeast. Is it you? Hey, you there! Have you seen a little girl? She's a little shorter than you and- Wait, that's- The sun! Are you our savior? I- Yeah? Oh my stars! Sorry for my rudeness. Uh, it's, it's all right. Are you looking for someone? My, my little sister, she's been gone for three days now. I've been looking all over, but what does she look like? Um, a little shorter than you, long blue hair, two blue feathers on top of her head. Sorry, I haven't seen anyone like that. 
Where was the last place you saw her? Back inside the ruins. She said she was headed toward the forest, so I'm waiting here now. I ran out of places to look. Okay, well, we'll keep an eye out for her. So he's looking for Alula. Alright, this place is really big, so it says that the game auto saves when we close it, and uh, we're just gonna have to leave it here. Sorry, guys. So that is it for today's episode. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you're on YouTube, I'd appreciate a like and subscribe. It's one or two clicks for you. It really does help me out a ton. And as always, hope you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.